Okay, we are completing our unplugged activity. We are coming to a close and our groups are working together. So, young ladies, what have you guys come up with? Do you all have a consensus of your coding? Mm -mm. Ours is completely different. It's completely different. So, what kind of differences are you guys recognizing? Let's start with one image for in particular. And let's look at the differences and see what needs to be corrected. So you want to look at which image do we want to take a look at that's different? Okay, so this here is your image two, and this is your image two. And if we come here and look at the image, let's go ahead and see what the code is for this one, ladies. So if we start from the left at the top in the first cell, what is the first set of code that you have? You have fill in with space and you have fill in with space. Okay? So now our next cell, let's see what you did. What direction did you go in? You move, you move square down and you move. No, no, that's not back. This look like down. We will have a picture booth for pictures to capture for the entire Which direct, you no went you went this way? Okay, hours. so guess what? Uh, I think it's still yes, right. It's, it's the way we did yes. the code. So let's check it to see if your code will still get us that image and if your code will get us that image, okay? So you have fill in, then move, move down, left, left. This fill in with color, move down, move left, fill in with color. Now, when you filled in with color, what did you do right here? Oh, you went down. That's still correct, isn't it? Do you agree? What happened was you two wrote your code in two different orders in two different directions, okay? I'm going to give one of you extra credit. We need to research and find out doesn't matter where we begin, as long as that code is written so that we can navigationally get through and fill in those squares. Which one of y'all interested in doing that? I give you extra credit. Now let's check hers. Okay, she has fill in square. That's right. She has, what is this right here? Okay. Logically, I like that better. Logically. You want me to tell you why? Not to say that yours is wrong and it's bad. But let's look at here how you started. You have fill in. Instead of going, why not go fill in square with color, fill in square with color. Oh, I'm looking at it's three. Okay, I'm okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Miss Moten messed up. Fill in square. Right. Fill in square. Right. Fill in square. Right. Fill in square. I had that at first, but I switched it. Yeah. So, so, so you got you have it. You understand. Mm -hmm. So, um, go ahead and take a look at the other images and do a comparison now. Now that we see that it's co okay to come from a different direction until one of you guys research and let us know otherwise, right? Um, one additional announcement: the robotic team will meet today. We want to discover whether it matter makes a difference. Where we start our code. Can we start our code from any point? When when um, writing code for images, we want to write code to draw an image. Does it matter where the code starts or begin? Okay. Okay, um, do, do not forget to turn in you and your group's um, sheets. You can come up here and drop them off. 
One person can do it for all. Thank you. Appreciate it. Did you learn something, little lady? Yes. I'm glad you did. Thank you. Thank you. And welcome. What's your name? Okay, this is her very first day, and she did wonderful. I thought she was here all quarter. Great job. Such a pretty girl, too. And this is my leader. She takes my pictures. She's my videographer. Okay, this Taylor. Okay, he, he come up in here with us, too. He trying to get in there. Did you learn anything about coding today, Taylor? That's what's up. 